Be vigilant. Communication. A team from the Europe-Africa branch of the Naval Criminal Investigative Service, or NCIS, visited Suda Bay to provide security training. The STAT team is um, S-T-A-A-T. So we are a um, security training assistance and assessment team. Basically what we do is, for NCIS, we work directly for the director of NCIS, and we're basically a training arm for them. Yeah, we actually travel to all the Navy bases within um, Europe, Africa, and Southwest Asia. So, um, you know, we're responsible for all of those bases. The STAT team administered active shooter response and surveillance detection training during their visit to Suda Bay. Last week we did the active shooter course, and the goal of that course is, you know, just to give some basic tactics and techniques. Uh, we have a lot of junior people that normally are straight out of A school, especially here in Suda Bay. So we try to get them some basic tactics and techniques so they can overcome the active shooter scenario and come out alive. First day or so is PowerPoints. Uh, from there we move on to basic room entry techniques. Uh, from there we actually get into the action, so that's the, that's the fun part around day three and four. Uh, they start taking out the weapons, we do weapons familiarization, we go over to safety, and then the last day it's all action. Roger, solid rain, Ralph. This is a CNO priority course. Uh, as you know, we've had a rise in active shooter scenarios, uh, more so stateside, uh, but we definitely want people to be prepared and to know how to react and how to respond to these situations. They perform beautifully. I like to say that, you know, most junior sailors coming out of A school, they have an empty cup. So it's a lot easier to fill an empty cup versus a full cup. They were eager to learn, they were excited about the training, and a week flew by. The junior MA said they enjoyed the unique perspective the STAT team offered. This training is ran by NCIS, so it's not ran by our training department. So it's a little bit different training. They have a different background than some of our training guys have, so it's always interesting to see a new viewpoint on how to do things. To see tactical movements, going over the strategy of it, and why some things will work in certain situations and why they won't work in the others. I like knowing why stuff works. The STAT team will be moving on to provide this training to the Siganilla and Bahrain security teams. Petty Officer Andrew Brame, Suda Bay, Crete.